I got this bleach from eBay and not gonna lie, it's like really expensive, so I couldn't afford a developer. Okay, blonde me you could not buy the blonde me developer, but you can bought 20 volumes, you bought 40 volumes. So I just got a developer from a beauty supply store. It was really cheap. I'm really happy with blonde me and the blonde me is renewed, it's improved again, so it's getting better and you have these colors that you add to the bleach so it kills more yellow and orange pigments we use it in the salon and it goes very good i don't know how much powder i put in my cup but like i say it's my first time but there are tutorials on youtube and there are descriptions and you have to follow the descriptions maybe you should read the package it's it says on the package how much powder how much peroxide you have to use uh, no fine sections there's not enough bleach and you are very dark you have like a blue green on your head so you know you have to bleach it more than once so you know if you are going to bleach it more than once with 40 volumes it will kill your hair you have to apply it good fine sections enough product it's a very good thing that you did not bleach the roots so you see it's not all bad. So I'll be using it for like one to 30 minutes. Oh, 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 oh. Why are you leaving it so long? The first 30 minutes of a bleaching process, it's working the fastest. Like if you are lifting six levels, you will lift four levels in the thir first 30 minutes and then two levels in the next 30 minutes. So leaving it for one hour and a half, it's just damaging your hair and it will not lift more. So that's why I always say use 20 volumes, put it on for 30 minutes, rinse it out, and then apply again with 20 volumes. Less damage, kill more yellow pigments or orange pigments. A lot of things are going wrong, but hey, the title says it. It goes wrong. Oh my God. My head's gonna fall out, but look at how stretched my hair is. 40 volumes. 90 minutes. That's a result. So I use this and this. I think it's like a company, but I bought it at the Blue Supply Store as well as my um, bleach. If your hair is that damaged from bleaching with 40 volumes, a shampoo and a conditioner will not fix it. It's not like it's healed. Nope. Yeah, this is how my hair look, ew. The blue is not gone. You have, I don't know how many shades and it's dead. And we are just like two minutes in the video. Oof. Look at the length, look at the length. So it was blonde before and she put it some blue or green on top of that or it was a dark with ash in it, but it's, gummy it's so gummy look at it it's done it's noodle hair she's going to cut it but please take more time take finer sections than the bleach these are not sections these are not sections it's just combing to the front taking a strand and cutting it this hurts my eyes this hurts my eyes <sighs> why why do people do that? Just a sloppy bleach job and now a very sloppy cutting job. How can you have a nice even haircut if you are chopping it off like that? That is so bad. But this is noodles. Look, the shock on her face is real. But hey, the blonde pieces are nearly gone so you can put blue on top of that again. That's an idea. What have I done? Well, you bleached and cut it. I never thought I would go this short. <laughs> it's dead, so you don't have any choice. And if you're going to keep changing your color, it will get shorter and shorter and shorter. Do I need to stop trying to do stuff on my Oh, own? look at the long piece in the back. This is a life lesson that I need to learn. Stop doing stuff. Yeah, just stuff. cut it off. This is what you get. Yo, let me show you how to do something. Look at this. Oh, look at that. Look how stretchy it is. Oh, look at the back. 
This is really bad. Listen, with 20 volumes, you never, never, never had that problem. It's the 40 volumes that is killing your hair and it's not melting all the orange pigment. You cannot expect that you put 40 volumes on your hair and say, it's blonde. If it was that easy, ooh. I'm using this hair dye. A company sent me this. I'm so happy. And I look rough right now, too. I'm sick, y'all, I'm sick. So you're going to put some brown, red brown on top of that. Well. If you want to kill green, you have to put red, so the green will be gone, that's for sure. The color will fade so quickly, but it will be better and it will be less damaging, so that's a good thing. Okay guys, so it's been like an hour or something, something, I don't know. It will look better than the blonde, that's for sure. Why is everybody trying to go to blonde? I never understood that. Okay guys, okay guys, so my hair finally looks kind of dried up a little bit on the side, so I'm gonna go take a shower and I'll be right back after I get out. Yo, oh my god, what happened was my hair, it like the hair color, I think it's conditioner, I don't think it's a hair dye, like it fade away. And now I gotta use this backup that um when I first got my hair dyed at a salon to give me this um red color. So that it can enhance the color, right? And that's what I put it on right now. Yo, oh my freaking god, bruh. But that's normal. If you are putting a color on blonde without repigmentation, it's faded. It's 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 not good. You have to repigmentate the blonde. But it was good to cover the green, that's for sure. The thing I put in is um a conditioner. It's not a hair dye, it's a conditioner. So yeah, I'm gonna use this. Oh my gosh, she literally saved my freaking life, bro. Like, I'm gonna be walking to school, look all crazy and stuff. And you know, finding a red hair dye, finding a red hair dye is really, really hard. You, first you put it a color on, the blonde. It faded too fast. Then you did a color wax or a color conditioner. But was that was not good enough. And now you're going to put some box dye, red. Okay, so let's say the previous colors were used as a repigmentation and now you're going to color it, okay? At the end, I think it will be okay. But yeah, this part is actually working, but like, see? I'm glad. But this side is kind of dark though, and this side is a little brighter. But stay tuned, I'm gonna update y'all, I'm gonna dye my hair again tomorrow on Monday I just watched her channel to see if we can see some part 2 for the result there's no part 2 there are other videos with red hair like she has now so not much changed but what I see is that it's not dry so it's possible that her hair is over processed and it's drying anymore it isn't drying anymore so that happens if you are over processing your hair it stays like moisture it stays wet you cannot dry it if that happens it's not good press one of these videos to see more hair fails and hair tips have you learned from this video have you been entertained by this video please give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel press that notification bell you can follow me on instagram you can follow me on facebook you can follow me on tiktok all i'm going to say today is ciao kus.